Order! 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 You are an incorrigible delinquent at times. <laughs> Behave yourself, man! Finally tonight, actually just before we came on air, we actually managed to reach on, uh, via the web, a senior figure in Russian athletics, Mikhail Butov. He's the General Secretary of the All-Russia Athletic Federation, and we wanted to get his response to the extraordinarily damning report yesterday into doping in Russian athletics, the Independent, independent Commission under Dick Pound. Well, I began by asking Mr Butov uh, for his response to that report. When I received this information yesterday after the confer press conference, and uh, of course immediately started uh, to, to, to research it, and uh, according to IWF rules, uh, we'll, of course we'll start to prepare any explanations about uh, uh, this um, document, and uh, of course we'll send our explanation and our uh, arguments. Uh, in two days. Are you yes. saying that you accept that the doping has been occurring because the, 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 the Dick Pound report says everybody knew? Are you accepting that it did happen or are you saying it didn't happen? I think 75% of this document is not new for everybody, for everybody from athletics because we already started to uh, started to investigate uh, many many processes what uh, what we uh, what presented in this document right but and look just sorry it, sorry again i just the report said the doping was continuing up until june this year so well after the investigation has begun they're still finding doping now are you uh, accepting that that was happening in june this year yeah yeah i can tell you uh, what what is what is uh, what does mean continue uh, you know the situation. We we know our problem. We know a problem with the doping, and of course we should uh, change uh, mentality of uh, many coaches, especially coaches in the regions. And we started to do it very very hard. We started in April. We organized some uh, educational program. We uh, what is the most important? Me and. Uh, uh, head coach uh, Yuri Borzakovsky and uh, interim president Vadim Zelechonek. We met with a lot of coaches, with a lot of athletes. We, it's very important to uh, to uh, direct uh, every every athlete with this explanation, with uh, our uh, vision of uh, anti-doping, anti-doping uh, uh, intention in Russia. And uh, it's absolutely real steps. The Dick Pound found that ARAF, your organization, was not cooperative with his investigation. Many people in it were obstructing his investigation. That doesn't imply you've learned the lessons of, of, of being exposed for cheating. I cannot, I cannot accept it because, firstly, nobody from what the Commission contacted uh, Federation during last months. Nobody contacted interim president, nobody contacted myself. It's never, no, never contacted us. Of course, they contacted a lot of people in Russia, but never uh, the achievement of the Federation. If you are kicked out of the Olympics next year, the Rio Olympics, what will, what will your reaction to that be? What will you do? You know, firstly, uh, I'm absolutely uh, sure that uh, we should be against any, any uh, limitation of uh, athletes' participation in the highest level uh, competitions. We have absolutely new generation. It's very successful young athletes like Shubinkov, Kuchina this year. Elena Isinbayo is coming back next year. We are absolutely sure that that's absolutely clean athletes. And uh, uh, I think if uh, such such uh, decision will be done uh, against uh, our team, it will be against. Uh, uh, clean athletes, not against uh, the problem athletes. Then, please, uh, I am absolutely against the isolation of any federation, not only ours, uh, any federation, because you know the problem with doping is not only in Russia. You know the situation uh, what announced in Kenya, in India, and in other countries. You're I saying they dope as well, those other countries? Sorry? Kenya and India, you're saying they are dopers as well, like Russia? No, it's the number of uh, doping cases. It's uh, uh, open information. It's open case. Uh, the cases, number of cases. It's a lot of cases. 
So it's nothing else. I don't know. I am not specialist in any uh, other country's uh, situation. But what I know well is that the uh, doping problem is not only in Russia. It's also the problem of our sports, unfortunately. We should fight against it. And I'm sure that isolation of any federation is not the good way. Thank you very much for talking to us. Much appreciated. Yeah, thank you very much. And that is all we have time for. It's been a packed day. I'll be back tomorrow. Good night.